it's been a reoccurring theme actually so we want to book that trend we don't want to play badly we want to play well and win of course but uh, winning is the order of the day um, and I, I do think we've played well and we've played well enough to win Birmingham was an excellent performance and uh, we didn't get our just desserts and we were unlucky in that with the deflection but we've got to put that aside now and get on with Middlesbrough and then, well, Middlesbrough start, we've got two home games, Yeovil on Tuesday. Important to go into the breakdown on a, such a positive, really. It was, yeah. Do you know what? It, it, it was a positive and yet we, what was nice, I think all the players felt like we'd lost. Yeah. We're disappointed, we should have won the game. But nevertheless, it was a positive, it was an away point and we know from last year how valuable you nick a point from somewhere or earn a point or get a point that should have been three, it doesn't matter. You just keep picking them up and uh, it's your tally at the end of the season that counts. Such as the Championship, no game for two weeks, two games in four days, but both at home and a platform to really push on. Yeah, uh, Middlesbrough are a decent side. I think they've had similar starts. I think they've won one and they've drawn three. They're you know, better off with points than we are. Um, but not really set the world on fire yet. Uh, We've watched them a couple of times from their from their games. Got reports on them. They're a decent team. They've got a good squad of players, I think. Uh, play four three three. You know, it'll be a hey. Listen, it'll be a tough game. They came down here last year, and Terry was in charge, and we won four. Maybe I should stay off sick. <laughs>